Hey, welcome to another episode of the Bobby Experience. Uh, man, I just got a call today, uh, just today, this last minute uh, call for an audition uh, for my agency, uh, Babes and Bows, uh, saying that you got auditioned for me today uh, for Empire, uh, that show with uh, Lucius Lyon, uh, yeah, played by uh, Terrence Howard. Yeah, so uh, another b uh, big name network TV show, so I... Uh, Got dressed up, I uh, got my uh, headshot and uh, resume uh, ready. I'm gonna be uh, heading over pretty soon. Uh, got my contacts in. Uh, just got the email uh, about the lines, uh, this two-liner, and uh, pretty short and sweet. Uh, all right, so I'm just gonna head on over and uh, thought I'd uh, just record this. Someone recommended I uh, make a vlog out of this too. But So apparently you guys, uh, People out there like watching these, so uh, thought I'd document it. All right, I'll uh, start moving. So one of the advantages of having a flexible schedule is to be able to go on auditions, even at the very last minute when you get a phone call. Um, day of. So if I had a regular nine to five, uh, where I had to be scheduled, had to come in, and I wouldn't be able to do that. And I think of how, like, how bummed I'd be uh, saying, hey, I can't come in for this audition because I gotta work. And uh, generally our agencies want you to be uh, flexible. And so uh, I'm just so glad I can make this, that my schedule allows it. Um, yes, yeah, so definitely gotta have a flexible schedule to be able to make auditions that are so last minute like this. I'm still happy for the opportunity that it gets, uh, put my acting chops to work. And uh, once again, I'd like to just say that uh, I try to see the audition as a, a performance itself. And uh, with, you know, uh, just be uh, satisfied with, with the outcome. All right, so I haven't followed Empire lately. I think I watched a couple episodes after the first season. Uh, the only reason I haven't Continue been following on North the, sh the show for five is, uh, miles. as much as before is because uh, I don't have regular TV, I just have internet, so I'm watching Netflix and YouTube uh, mostly, and uh, times when I do watch TV, it's over at uh, some local sports bar for some sporting events or, you know, some other, some other things, uh, but uh, one of the things I like about, em I like about Empire is uh, you have a musical performances every episode. You, you'll hear, uh, what, two or three songs? So uh, I'm pretty sure that's how the show it continues to be, where you have uh, these performances and that, and you, and you can purchase their music too. Uh, yeah, the Empire's uh, soundtrack for their, uh, for their seasons. So that's uh, one of the things I you know, liked about that show. Uh, it's, it's something I find uh, inspirational is that uh, the character that plays that plays Cookie, uh, she went to Hollywood around the age of, what, 35? And she had a kid. I think she had a son. And people were telling her, uh, you know, she's not going to make it out there. And look where she is now. I mean, she's, she has a big role on, on this show, Empire. And uh, just goes to show, I mean, it's, it's never really too late to... Uh, pursue uh, pursue your dreams you know to it's not too late to be ambitious and uh, you know shoot for these goals so that's what uh, I find to be pretty encouraging we're right, back here once again to Cine space Claire Simon casting I'm here 30 minutes early so it gives me a good time to rest relax and uh, go over my lines to myself here we go Here's a quick view of the waiting room here in Simon Casting. As you can see, that they have these posters of different films and things and shows. Okay, so I wrapped up uh, this one, another one in the books, an audition for Empire. I guess I can say uh, the more I do these, the more comfortable, uh, positive, and confident you know I get. Uh, Makes me sometimes think that, hey, maybe relocating to Los Angeles may not even be necessary. 
but it's so, still something that I want to be able to do. Uh, you know, be out there because that's where um, where film is. Uh, I, I like the way it looks over there, and I like the weather. Seeing the how oh, there's this big glare here, you know, the palm trees uh, looks really nice over there, and seeing the Hollywood sign. But anyways, uh, I realize you know I can't control like the outcome in the end of whether they choose to have me for the role or not. Uh, but what I can control is, you know, my attitude, you know, how I approach it, you know. I could come in there thinking, you know, I, I never land these roles. And uh, that kind of thinking, you know, creeps in. You know, it's, it's pretty common that I think, um, you know, me and some other folks would think, you know, we don't get these parts. Um, but I, you know, I did the opposite. I came in there just being uh, grateful that I get to perform in an audition and uh, realize that not everybody gets the chance to uh, go for these, uh, these parts. Um, yeah, I'm walking around, I'm sorry for the glare. Uh, but uh, I wanna make sure that I leave at the bottom of the screen uh, info uh, for my agency, Babes and Bows. I just wanna thank them also for uh, having me have this audition. Uh, so their info, I put it in print down uh, here. Uh, their babes and bows, and uh, left their email and uh, address as well. It's also be in the description of this video. But this is Bobby once again for the Bobby Experience. Uh, you'll be seeing more of me. All right, break a leg out there, folks, and uh, yeah, keep up the good work. Talk to you soon. Bye bye. <laughs>